Okay guys, so Eric just told me that the underglow kit is all wired up, so we're gonna go out there right now. Let's go. We're gonna see this together. I have in front of me the world's cheapest underglow kit I have ever seen in my entire existence. I don't know how. I don't understand how my brother found this. He found it and sent me the link and I purchased it and I had to buy it. I am just in shock right now and I'm about to show you guys the kit right now. Here we go. Let's check this out. I am holding in my hands the cheapest underglow kit on the market right now for $2 I got this for. Look at it with my hands. Look at this. Ready? One hand and then, dude, that my I have two hands that are bigger than this. I don't know how this is going to look on the B or Z, but probably really goofy you know what this means we got to open it up right now so we can see what we're getting ourselves into all right so let's see what's included in this underglow kit as i am really excited to see so let's pull it out of the packaging right here so we have looks like four different strips so it's gonna be one for the front <laughs> two for the sides and one for the back but i don't even know if we can really do that i think we're gonna have to do just two on each side for the side skirt i don't know exactly how I should go about this. This is the size of each strip. All the strips are the same here, so I am very intrigued to see how this is gonna go on the BRZ because it is wide-bodied and it's just way bigger than a stock car, and this would not even fit a stock car. All right, let's go to the garage and pull the BRZ in so then we can start installing this kit. Honestly, you're probably better off putting it on the Focus or the Civic right here than the BRZ, but this is gonna be really funny. So here is the BRZ right here, and I just really have no idea how we're putting this on the car right now. I don't even know where my old under glow kit is at if I can even find it these are the old underglow strips that I had on the car and you could just see how big these are compared to the two dollar kit that I got I'm gonna do a size comparison right now for you guys so you can just see the difference this is too funny I'm <laughs> I'm gonna show you guys <laughs> all right here we go let's look at it right now here we go ready so I have the strip in my hand this is what it looks like compared to the old strip that was on the side of the car. <laughs> this is crazy, dude. There's no way this is about to go on my car. There's no way. You versus the guy she tells you not to worry about. Like, come on now. All the strips in the kit, and it doesn't even come out to as big as the one strip I had in my car. This is going to be so bad. I don't even know how this is going to go on my car right now. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? I cannot believe I'm doing this right now. That I'm putting this on the car just for it to look so goofy. All right, BRZ, I am so sorry we're about to do this to you, but I got to pull you in the garage to give you an upgrade that you're going to regret in about a second after I put it on. Okay, so here's a little reference of how big these strips are compared to the car. I really have no idea what I'm doing here and how I'm gonna go about this. I have to find a way to make this look somewhat decent so then it just, you know, makes a good video. Unless maybe I just do two in the front and then one on each side and then that'll be the, the underglow. Maybe I could do that. So we have one of the strips already all hooked up and we're just gonna run every single wire to the battery. So this is the first one that's all done. And I'm gonna put this on right now. Okay, now all the strips are on and Eric's just gonna finish wiring them all to the battery so then they can all turn on. I really have no idea how this is gonna look on this car. I'm very scared to see what happens. I'll catch up with you guys once we get everything hooked up and we're ready to go. Okay guys, so Eric just told me that the underglow kit is all wired up, so we're gonna go out there right now. Let's go. We're gonna see this together. <laughs> Yo, what? What is that, dude? What? Oh my gosh, look how big of a gap there is underneath the car. On the side real quick. And yo, look how much this covers, man. This is literally the size of my hand covering the car. Like, that's literally nothing. This side over here is completely peeling off right now. Look at this, half of it's already off. That's actually really funny though. I cannot believe we just put this on the car. This looks so goofy. I feel like I should go to some car meets like this and see what people say. Eric, what do you think of the new underglow kit? The world's cheapest underglow kit. How are your thoughts on this? For this being $2, I mean, I would get it for my Civic. Yeah, yeah, we should just buy 
like five of these kits and we'll have the full size of the vehicle on this car right here. Maybe we should do a comparison on the world's cheapest underglow to the world's most expensive underglow. That would be really funny to see the big difference on that. But the funniest part about this whole kit is that it only turns green. At least it matches the car color a little bit, but overall, I mean, you can't really be upset for $2. This is what you're gonna get. What do you guys think? Is this worth it, the $2 underglow kit? I mean, it's only two bucks, so it's like pocket change to throw on a car. Really can't be upset. I mean, what are we gonna do? Just throw it on for the video and then throw it off. It's two bucks. At least it gave us a video to show you guys. If you guys wanna see how we wired this, we literally had every single strip running to the battery. So you can see here, there's one underneath here, one coming from back there for the side. And then there's another one from the side right there. And then this one is for the other front right here by my foot. It was very simple to do. It took us about five minutes to throw this full kit on. I mean, you really can't expect anything. Now, if I was gonna drive this, how long it would last for? Probably two seconds, but it was for the video. So it made a lot of sense to just do it this way to show you guys how it looks. That looks way better. We got everything matching with the headlights right here and the underglow. I think this looks, I think this is just a look now. I think now we have to keep this underglow kit on the car as this just looks so aggressive. <laughs> I don't know, what do you guys think? I mean, this was kind of fun just to throw on for a video for you guys. I mean, really can't expect much. And I'm actually very happy about how it actually worked and did not give us any problems with wiring it. Anyways, guys, that's gonna be it for today's video. Thank you all so much for watching. If you guys wanna see any other content, please drop a comment down below. Let me know what you guys wanna see. I'm always down to show something or experiment something. So this is literally like exactly an example right here. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. I'll see you all in the next video. Peace out.